In this video, I'll be showing you how to create retargeting ad. Retargeting ad is very important because it helps you to retarget people that showed some level of interest in your product or your services. You know, when you are running ad, initially your ad is going to show to several people and it is not all of them that will be interested in what you are selling. So after some time, you need to retarget people that showed some level of interest. And that is why retargeting ad is very, very important. If you are running ad and you are not retargeting, you are leaving a lot of money on the table. So for you to retarget, the first thing you need to do is to create your retargeting audience so i'm going to be showing you how to create your retargeting audience right away so you go to your when you are in your ad manager account you are in your ad manager you have logged into your ad manager and for the purpose of this video i am using computer okay so you are going to go to this all tool you can see it here this all to click on it but audience is here already in case audience is not here you just go to all two and when you are in all two you are going to locate audience and make sure it is the account you want to use that you have selected ensure you take note of the account you have selected in case you have several other accounts for me, I have several ad accounts. So select the one you have and you are going to click on create. Then click on custom audience. There are several parameters here for the purpose of this video. I want to pick facebook page you can pick instagram account you can pick customer list this customer list has to do with if you have an email list some people have subscribed to your email list you can upload that list to this place so that you can target those people you know some people will opt in and never buy your product so you can retarget them that is what this customer list is about or perhaps you have a list of customers who have purchased your product and services before you have their phone number their name their email address you can tablet them you can write it them in an excel sheet then you now upload it here that is what this customer list is about now let's go to let's start from facebook page okay so i select facebook page i select next then i select that particular page i want to work with know where the page is this is the page I want to work with. Select it. And you can see, let's start from number one here. Number one here says account center. Who currently like or follow your page? Okay. For this, people that currently follow your page, you are going to retarget them. Okay, so you can name it. Write the name of your page in case you have so many pages so that you will not be confused when you want to select them. With this now, I can always identify when I want to use it and click create audience. Okay, let's click done for now. That one has been created. We'll go again custom audience 
see you on facebook page click next then make sure the page is still selected click on the drop down now now we are in the second place now that is everyone who engage with your page okay and of course the date is one year 365 days okay, give it enough allowance so that you don't lose those people okay you are going to give it a name those people who engaged with okay write the name clearly describing who they are so that when you are targeting them you can always know you will not make mistake we are still on facebook page next and this time around you go to anyone who visited your facebook page okay anyone who visited your Facebook page. Anyone who visited instead of your, I'll write the name of the page so that when I want to use it, it will not mix with other pages that I'm managing. Okay, and click create. Done. I'm still there. Uh, page next select the page and this time around we'll go to the fourth place which is account center who engage with any posts okay and this is facebook post okay i will give it a name people who i click creates audience done we are still creating more ensure you create all of them so that you don't miss those that showed some level of interest in what you are doing okay this time around we are here now people who click on call to action write the name of the page okay more custom audience facebook page next this drop down account center okay people who message people who message your page create done we are still creating more custom audience page next select the page we have done that of message so we need to click on this drop down okay this time around you select people who saved any post you now some people will save your posts so you need to retarget those people some people will see your ad for one reason or the other they may decide to save it so that they don't forget some things or they have they find something very useful but they are not ready to take action immediately they save your your page they save your posts or your video they saved it you are going to retarget those people they they somehow they have interest in what you are doing so you need to retarget them they are potential buyers though they are not buying immediately but they are potential buyers custom you still select facebook page next mm -hmm. okay so i'm going to click on this drop down again 
Now you can see that some things are hidden here. To bring it up, you are going to click on Control on your keyboard. You see that the screen have hidden some things. So you click on Control and the minus key on your keyboard. Control plus minus key so that it will re reduce the. Now you see at the top right, you see that the screen is actually reducing now. Can you see that? Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. I see that nothing is hidden now. Okay, that means we are done with Facebook page. Okay. Now let's create more custom audience. This time around, let's go to Instagram. For Instagram, I've already created some Instagram already. So I'm going to complete the ones that are remaining. You can see I've created Instagram followers. Okay, so I will create, I will select Instagram, next, then select the page and click on this drop down. I have already created for this. The next I need to create is people who sent message. Okay. And I'm going to give it a name. Give them a name. People. Who sent indicate Instagram so that it doesn't mix with that of Facebook because you already have uh, those who send message to your Facebook account so we need to separate the name so that when you are using them you will know how to pick them good let's create more custom audience and i'm going to go to instagram next select the instagram and click on this drop down we have already seen sent message let's reduce our screen size our screen test okay we what we want to pick now is those who saved any of our posts you know if you are creating a valuable content in your on your page or in your advertisement some people will definitely save your your post so you need to retarget those kind of people instagram posts click save okay so done i think that is the end of that so the next thing we want to do is for video meta video okay so we we'll select video so i'm going to select video meta sources select video click next here you are going to select type of engagement select 50 percent people that have watched your video to 50 percent they are somehow interested okay so we are going to select the video here select the video first select the video source which is your facebook page you can select your instagram professional account your campaign now let's select 
facebook page and select your select your facebook page and you are going to select the the video I selected that video let's click confirm and let's give it a name okay that is it at this point i can save it now so that is how you are going to do for all the relevant videos that i want to target and is a way of creating rapport with your audience you know if if people are watching your video regularly they get used to you and these are people that can buy your products and services it is those that are used to you that believe in you that can buy your product and services so these are the kind of people you need to retarget. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next video.